others, game results, and your daily lunch menu. And more on today's news. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, hot dogs. I'm Thomas. I'm Yasmin. And, and we're, we're your, your new, new hosts. hosts. For lunch today, we'll be having line one and two hot dogs, line three closed, line four soup and salad bar with potato soup or barbecue sandwiches, line five pepperoni or cheese wedges. Now to Israel with sports. Thanks guys. The volleyball team fell to Jennings County. The team struggled playing without their lead blocker, Allison, Allison Timmons, against three much taller teams. Stats for the team include Lindsey Gay with 40 assists and 11 kills, Ashley Timmons with 23 kills, and Clara Roberts with 20. Tara Martinez added 22 digs while Bella Kobe came in strong at the net with four blocks. Morgan Adamson added eight kills, and Mae Sterling and Kyle Norman each had 18 digs. Sydney Whitaker came in came in and served for the team who was 100% behind the line. The team moves to the record two and three and prepare, prepare for the conference rival North Tuesday evening in Quesar, Quesar Arena. And soccer news, uh, the boys won the hot dog in live by the score of four to nothing. Scoring the hot dogs were Daniel, Daniel Mejia Cervantes, sophomore Christian Mejia, and sophomore Giovanni Tornado Lins, who scored twice. Senior Leonardo Mejia and Rodolfo Garcia Cruz. Freshman Michael Cardenas, who each scored an assist in the match. Frank Moore is now 2 and 1 for the season and traveled to Harrison on Tuesday for their next match. Congratulations, guys. There will be a, a wrestling call up meeting up right after school here in the HGTV studio. Girls basketball will, will also have a call up meeting August 29th in room 43 at 2.55 to 3.05. I'm Israel, Ange I'm Israel Angeles Jr. Now back to you, Thomas. You got this. Oh my God. Good morning, hot dogs. Today we'll have areas of rain and thunderstorms with a high of 72 and a low of 66. Precipitation of 66% and humidity of 98%. Today's winds will be at 11 miles per hour. These storms will go into tomorrow, so don't forget to bring an umbrella. I'm Thomas, now back to your studio. Eric Escobar won the Els Jewelers Jewelry Design Contest, which is a competition held every year. The contest allows you to create a design that will be made into actual jewelry. Congratulations! One of our wonderful corporate partners is hosting a special fundraiser to support the kids receiving care at Riley Hospital. On Thursday, August 29th, Papa John's will donate 20% of the day's per daily proceeds to Riley. All you need to do is share the news with your school, friends, and family. So make your way to Pop Papa John's on August 29th. Frankfurt DECA is continue continuing to its eighth year of DECA Backpack Buddies. Today, Backpack Buddies has been able to distribute 35,597 foot bags to 140 Frankfurt K-8 K through eight students for 35 weeks. To accomplish this goal this year, Frankfurt DECA must raise $14,700 in financial and product donations. If you wish to donate, contact Ms. Graham Bishop. Juniors and seniors, don't forget to continue to sign up in the office to meet college reps. It is not too early to consider colleges and begin to ask questions. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like that like button and subscribe. You'll be seeing more of us. <laughs> Have a happy Monday. Have a good day, Daniel. Did you see me? I was like, crap.